Good morning, dear hearts. We are on lesson six, and please subscribe if you've not yet done so. So today's lesson is a very obvious continuation from yesterday's lesson. Yesterday's lesson was, I'm never upset for the reason, I think. And today's lesson is giving us part of that reason, and it's saying I'm upset because I see something that is not there. I'm going to make this a short video because tomorrow's lesson, which is a fave, is really going to explain this in greater depth, and I don't want to go there yet. So today's lesson, if I'm going to boil it down and condense it to only one word, it's going to be about perception. I am perceiving something. I'm not seeing something. I'm perceiving something because I'm using the body eyes. I'm not really seeing anything at all, and we'll get to that in later lessons as well. But I see something based on my perception and it upsets me. It said, the lesson is I'm angry because I see something that is not there. I'm worried because I see something that is not there. Um, and of course it's the fill in the blanks. I'm worried about because I see something that is not there. Uh, this lesson is to be applied to anything during your day as you walk about, drive about, um, your world and if anything comes to mind that just causes a bit of unease okay because we like to minimize the ego likes to minimize our fear by giving us other words for it but angry and worried and upset and uh, concerned those are all really words that the ego has given us to make us think it's not really that bad but as we found out I'm either in peace or I am not. So if I'm not in peace, yeah, it's kind of bad. I need to get out of there. I need to get back out of my upset and back to my peace because it's only in my peace where I can thrive. It's only in my peace that I want to be. So this lesson continues and it uses some of the same blessings because they're in italics that we had from yesterday of reminding us there's no such thing as a small upset. They're all equally disturbing to my peace of mind. And I want to get back to my peace of mind because that is where I choose to be. That is where I can truly, um, I can truly breathe. I can truly enjoy this moment that I'm in. So again, we're reminded that I can't keep this upset and get rid of the rest, or I cannot even get rid of this one and keep the rest. I want to get rid, I want to release everything that has ever disturbed my peace. And I'm realizing that it's because I'm seeing what is not truly there. We'll go more into that tomorrow with tomorrow's lesson. Um, three, four times a day, unless you're very well versed with the course, go for it. Um, and otherwise, I'll see you here tomorrow. Please like, share, and subscribe, and comment. Namaste.